in the ring from the Andromeda Galaxy. Recently escaped from Area 51. She's more than a woman because she's the galaxy's greatest alien, Chris Statlander. here at Fresh Blood. Singles action on tap as the galaxy's greatest alien, Chris Statlander, goes one-on-one -on -one with her hand-picked opponent, the obsession, Caleb Conley. I'm Randy Carver, joined here by the master of ceremonies, the voice of Limitless Wrestling, Rich Palladino. How you doing, Rich? I'm doing great, thank you for having me. I'm gonna salvage what's left of my voice just to sit here and talk to you, boss. I'm glad, I appreciate it. We got a fun one on tap here. Chris Statlander, been on a roll this year in Limitless Wrestling preserving her career last month, defeating Jeremy Leary and Skyler. She teamed with Ashley Vox. And Caleb Conley in his debut, maybe trying to end this one early. And I love the uh, haircut that you gave Jeremy Leary. I was a huge fan of the haircut, <laughs> and I can't wait to see it later. So who would have the best hair in pro wrestling now if Jeremy Leary doesn't have any? That's, uh, that's another chapter in the book. Right now, I can tell you, standing up in that ring before the introductions, Caleb Conley said he is going to beat the you-know-what out of Chris Statlander. And Chris Statlander, not going to hand-pick an opponent to come in here and lose. Shoulders down of Caleb Conley. And off the ropes, Chris Stat with a low clothesline to the obsession and current NWA power star, Caleb Conley. Oh, you stole my thunder. I was going to get I'm that sorry. in there. That's OK. I'm That's... sorry, and a double wet willy. <laughs> As an old man that grew up watching studio wrestling, it's great to see Ed W.A. Power and what they're doing on YouTube. It and is. And to see Caleb Conley a part of it. Uh, Well-traveled veteran, Caleb Conley. Uh, the hand-picked opponent, as, as has been stated over and over, of Chris Statlander. And Chris Statlander has quickly become the it wrestler. I don't want to say the it girl. She has become one of the most sought-after talents in professional wrestling. She's accomplished so much so damn fast, and it's great to see her here in Limitless Wrestling. Absolutely. Over the past year, we've seen her rise and beyond wrestling GCW. Really, anywhere Chris Statlander goes, she's successful. Yeah, she spent a lot of time in chaotic oh. wrestling as well as she uh, connects right there. And <laughs> what a combination. Right across the chest, hooks that leg, and gets kind of two from referee Kevin Quinn. They're giving him a workout early on. <laughs> That's all right. Kevin Quinn's in phenomenal shape. One of the best referees in the business. Oh, my God. Incredible shape. You only bring the best up here to Maine. Absolutely. That's why Eric Greenleaf's on the roster. I kid. I kid. They don't like him. I know. I know. <laughs> Chris Statlander trying to break the grip of Caleb Conley, and she does. But Caleb weaves through the whip. Chris Stat. Oh, drop. Jeez. Abdomen first on the top rope. Very fortunate that she was able to land back inside the ring. Outside, that would have been a catastrophe. Yeah, I thought she was going to take a tumble there for a moment. And now Caleb Conley, an insane amount of air, and then pressure coming down once again on the abdomen region of Kay uh, Chris Statlander. Excuse me, only a one count. Very arrogant cover. Put one hand across the, uh, the chest and midsection to go for the pin. And uh, Chris Statlander quickly kicking out. Statlander, product of the Creative Pro Wrestling Academy. Oh, oh. Booted Jeez. her in the face. He sure did. There's a cover once again. Only two as Statlander gets the shoulder up. And yeah, a lot of a lot of Creative Pro students make their way through Limitless Wrestling. And she's at the top of the list of the most impressive to come out of Creative Pro, in my opinion. 
I was very fortunate to uh, visit the school for a couple of days while I was in Long Island, and I got to see Chris Statlin when she was just, just breaking in. One, two, and I think people forget how long she's been wrestling. To my knowledge, she's only been wrestling right around two years now, which is, it's absolutely insane, the strides that she's made in, in under three years, as you said, becoming one of the IT wrestlers, not only in the Northeast, but really all over the United States. A lot of buzz about Chris Statlander, trained by, of course, Pat Buck and Brian Myers, both of WWE fame at this point. Uh, Pat Buck, a behind the scenes uh, backstage agent, mm -hmm. and of course, Brian Myers is affectionately known as Kurt Hawkins. Of course. And former we... World Tag Team Champion, and uh, they did a hell of a job with this young lady. Ironically enough, she came out of the same camp as uh, well, our old friend MJF. Oh, yeah. <laughs> old Maxwell, Jacob Friedman, and... Look at this. You don't want to waste time. He's the obsession, time. man. He's got to let him know, and I, I talked to Caleb earlier today. He was a little frustrated at how this match was presented and how fans took it, because I think he realized just how popular Chris Statlander is in Limitless Wrestling, and I think he's, he's almost looked at as a, a dark horse in this matchup, and Caleb Conley, to my knowledge, you know, he's been wrestling over 10 years. He's been up the highways and byways, former former member of the Evolve roster, former member of the Impact Wrestling roster. Yes. He's been around. He certainly has, and he is uh, really taking it to Statlander, who just countered a uh, superplex attempt or whatever he was trying to do to get her out of that corner. Statlander, as you talked about, less than three years as a pro. Don't forget, former, oh, oh man. Beeled right into the corner. Lateral press, hook of the leg, and only a count of two. Statlander, former professional stunt woman, which kind of helped elevate her and escalate her um, <clears throat> her progression. Yeah, absolutely. In the now, business. We're seeing uh, a frustration really break out in Caleb Conley here as we saw that low uppercut to the spine of Chris Statlander. I think he thought it was it just a few moments ago. And uh, now I think Conley's wasting some precious time. <clears throat> Longtime veteran, but he is, uh, and he's paying for it right now. He absolutely is. Couple forearms and a chop for Caleb Conley. Oh. What a way to duck a clothesline there from Chris Stat. So athletic, former gymnast, former stunt woman, as I said. Big fist to the face, up and to the top rope. Chris Stapp been known to fly through the galaxy. Big Ooh. drop kick to Caleb Conley, sends him across the ring. And Statlander just soaking in the cheers of the crowd, hopefully not wasting too much time. She connects with the forearm, off the ropes again. Ooh, knee right to the side of the head. Statlander. Plants him down, shoulders down, Kevin Quinn, two, only two. From referee Kevin Quinn, the shoulder got up by Caleb Conley before the three count hit. See the frustration setting in now. Chris Statlander thinking, what do I have to do next? What do I have to do to put away the obsession, Caleb Conley? And hopefully she's formulated some kind of a game plan here because uh -oh. she picked the opponent. I'm sure she wants to beat the opponent. Looks like she was trying to pick him up for that tombstone. But Caleb Conley, I think he scouted Chris Statlander well. He knew what was coming. But Statlander lands on her feet. So Unbelievable. Athletic. Rolls through, back to her feet again. Sunset flip attempt. Conley rolls through. Look for the double stomp, but Chris Statlander evading and now trying to turn evasion into offense. One of these competitors oh. sets him out once more. One, two, only two once again. And a uh, very modified blue thunder bomb from a lower position, only a count of two. She and almost see, had it right she's there. She's questioning referee Kevin Quinn on the cadence, but he was right there in perfect position. The veteran Caleb Conley able to kick out. Well, you mentioned the frustration on Chris Allen. I think it's very apparent now that I, I think she's just trying to figure out what she has to do next to put away the obsession. She goes underneath and hoists him up on the shoulders. That's some power right there. That is, absolutely. Drops him face first. And maybe looking for that scissor kick off the rope, she goes into a split and he kicks her right in the side of the head. Unfortunate, yes. Just dropped her right on the back of her head and it's all Caleb Conley. Again, showboating, maybe wasting time. Yeah, and I'm surprised, again, a, a veteran like Caleb Conley wasting so much time in this contest, but you know, he, he's been successful, what can I say? 
And he's on the offensive right now, but Chris Statlander returning some forearms into a kick. Yeah, she was going for a shoulder block to the midsection. Conley one step ahead, wow. and now two steps, a double stomp right to the back. Down goes the Galaxy's greatest alien. The agility from the obsession is pretty amazing, to be quite honest. I hadn't seen Caleb Conley in quite some time before this match was suggested. To the top! Lands on his feet, unbelievable, but Chris Statlander out of the way. He catches the clothesline, looks for a back elbow, ducks the leg sweep. She is completely throwing him off his game, and that kick's not going to help. Finally got one that connected, ripcord. Caleb ducks the line, back oh. fist. <laughs> a Pele kick. Down goes Caleb Conley. And the fans truly appreciating this great action here tonight. Yarmouth, Maine, Limitless Wrestling, Fresh Blood. We thank you all for checking this out and appreciate your continued support of the best wrestling in the state of Maine, if I dare say so Hell myself. Hell yeah, the Pine Tree State Pro Wrestling Party. <laughs> and Caleb Conley has rolled to the floor now. Chris Statlander feeling the energy from a capacity crowd here in Yarmouth, Maine. And uh, she wants to be your leader, ladies and gentlemen. The alien's gonna fly. Here she comes. Takes down. Caleb Conley off the suicide dive. Now, oh, I've seen this before. Watch this. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable from Chris Statlander. Now throwing Caleb Conley back into the ring, maybe looking to end this one. She has a uh, new finisher called the Area 451. Oh, I've seen it. And we'll it's see a beauty. If, and I'm sure that's what she'd love to put her hand-picked opponent away with right here tonight. Conley placed on the second rope. Chris Statlander now heading to the top. Oh my goodness, down goes Caleb Conley, but he rolls through, shoulders down. Hoist her back up. What strength from the obsession. Not going into for the, the pin. corner. Oh, not going for the pin. Instead, the buckle bomb now into the suplex. Oh my God. One, two, and no. Unbelievable. The resilience of Chris Statlander on display as she gets the shoulder up at two and three fourths, and Caleb Conley cannot believe it. She is something special, and ladies and gentlemen, it's 2019. Intergender wrestling is pretty friggin' cool, and we're seeing it at its finest right here. Intergender wrestling is pro wrestling, man, and I'm, I'm excited right. to have so much of it here in Limitless Wrestling, but Chris Statlander kicks out at the count of one, and Caleb Conley looks like he's seen a ghost. Ooh. Hoist her up right on the shoulders after that slap to the face. Oh, Chris Stat, oh. it's in Rana! Good night. Back on the shoulders. The strength, the power, and like you said, the resiliency. As she drops that knee, drops down, drives the knee into the chest. Gut wrench. She's and hooking the legs, we've seen this before. Oh my God, dropped him on top of his head. And that is it. It certainly is. What a win for Chris Statlander. Here is your